It's 1.52 and I'm not napping today even though I'm running on about five and a half hours of sleep. So I did weigh in and uh, breakfast was both a protein coffee and a veggies made great muffin and I have been alternating between getting two loads of laundry done and put away and uh, helping kiddo with his schoolwork and watching Westworld. So, um, I'm, I've got more stuff I need to get done. I've got my craft table mostly cleared up so that I can do my birch box opening. Maybe. May have to wait till tomorrow. I don't know yet. I might just do it late tonight when the house is quiet and I don't need to run my air conditioner. So, I guess we'll see what happens there. And, um, yep, just lots of keeping the kiddo focused on school and, uh, getting ready to go drop them off at their dad's tonight. There is not a lot going on, like, at all. Dinner was, um, I'm not entirely certain like what this was. One of those types of meat is Mongolian beef. There's rice. There was a really zippy, I'm told it's Dan Dan noodles. And then there was a different kind of beef with a different sauce. And it was okay. It's 7.23 and this train is honking loudly. And I hate that. Um, I've got a massive headache and it turns out that there's a uh, beauty item that is no longer carried at Sally Beauty that I'm going to have to go to a specialty shop for tomorrow morning. I'm not complaining. I, I want the thing. They, just, they don't have the thing. And uh, the lady I help, I, that I talked to who helped me out, she was so nice. And wanted to make sure I knew exactly what it is I needed. Man. Curly hair is a journey. Made specifically difficult when you got to get into the intricacies of the genetics behind that curly hair. For instance, there are a lot of ethnic products that go great on Scottish curly hair. And then there are other ethnic products that just don't work as well on Caucasian hair. And then when you're doing, you know, braids on somebody with genetically ethnic hair, you need certain products. You do. And um, you're, it's like a whole curly spectrum. I have got this massive headache and at least people are being cool to me today. That's always a blessing. I've dropped my kids off with their other grandpa. He asked how we were doing after the big uh, loud rainstorm yesterday. I'm like, yeah, we're, we're good. No hail damage at our place. He's got a few uh, branches that are likely to come down, so... It's fine. I'm stopping in the grocery store to grab a couple of things because apparently nobody in my house can go more than three days without a trip to the grocery store. Can't be helped. All right. The headache is real though. Not fun. I did get on my inversion table earlier, flip myself upside down to swing for my feet. I don't think that contributed to the headache at all because this is pretty recent. I think I'm a little bit dehydrated. I think my stress is high. I think I need to work on earlier evenings. I need to turn in earlier. There's something like seriously wrong with me with the way I'm just not getting enough sleep. I can and should do better. I'm a little tiny bit behind on my calories for the day. 
think I'm gonna have some uh, stevia based chocolate when I get home oh man it's dark okay it is 903 and I am out here hatching Pokemon eggs because what else would I be doing in the middle of the night The rest of the neighborhood's kind of lit up, up at the front near the, near the highway, because somebody set up a snack stand. Everybody's got to go get their Cheetos and Takis. Probably homemade horchata too. Bad time to be on a diet. It's 12.43, and I did not manage to accomplish doing my birch box today, but I did managed to uh, hatch two Pokemon eggs and finish the entire first season of Westworld um, because why bother stretching that out over, you know, an entire week? I'll just, you know, get... It's, it's three discs, that's three days, right? You know, maybe... Maybe it, it uh, has something to do with the fact that I don't have a whole lot of stuff that I can do. I have to take breaks. And that those breaks can translate into TV time. Um, my, my brain was going so haywire earlier that I kept having to rewind and go through the same chunk again. And it's kind of like when you're reading and you get stuck on a paragraph and then you're like, I know I've read this 10 times, but what does it really mean? And then you go back and you start rereading the entire page until you remember where you were at so that you... Oh man, maybe I'm one of those robots stuck in the loop. Um, we are not doing Truman Show here. Well... <sighs> anyway, um, that was really, really good. I don't think I've seen a first season end like that ever. Like, I realized that the first season of a show should be just, here we are getting started, but at the same time, what if it's something really good that just does not get picked up, and then just, there should be a point where it can stop there? I don't know. I just know I want to go back to the library and get the next season, but I still have this movie that I also need to watch, uh, Dr. Strangelove, because I've never seen it, and apparently it matters, uh, so, it, to understand these gifts I keep seeing on Reddit, I, I need to watch this movie. Man, my neighbors are playing some loud music again. I am at 15% battery, and I need to keep this quick. I can't even recall what the two eggs were that I hatched, but one of them was a 10k egg and the other one was a 2k egg, so apparently just my usual walking around really got that 10k one to pop open and then the 2k one, that was, that was a decent walk. I mean, I had to push myself a bit, but I managed it. I managed my calories. I managed my active minutes goal and then some, and I managed my step count. Not my best work, still pretty good. It's fine. And, uh, there are many things I want to do tomorrow. I don't know how many of them are actually going to happen, but I can try. So, library? No. Maybe. Maybe. A uh, little bit of housework, a little bit of shopping, tiny, tiny bit of shopping. I swear, it's just a tiny bit. Um, not stuff that I was able to get at the grocery store. I am talking about other stuff. And uh, maybe, maybe that Birch Box video, if I keep telling myself I'm going to do it, then I might actually get to it. Anyway, we will we'll see how tomorrow goes. Thanks for sharing my day with me.